It's heartwarming seeing Hannah run around and uh, make friends with all of our animals. She loves the cows, loves the chickens wandering around, just loves being here in the barn with us. I love being able to work with my family every single day. My wife, Sarah, and I work well together. And honestly, that was one thing that I wondered about when we were making our business plan was, what's it going to be like to work with Sarah every single day, all day? I love her, I loved her then, and I enjoyed being with her. And that was one of the reasons we wanted to be back here was because with us working separate jobs, we hardly saw each other some days. Fortunately, it turns out that we work really well together. and We've learned to communicate effectively and uh, we've learned that nothing said when moving cows should be taken to heart. But working with my family has been the best part that I don't have another boss that I need to answer to that as long as I can do my best for my wife and my daughter and for my cows, uh, that's my ultimate responsibility. My parents bought this farm in 1988 when I was a year old and they milked cows here, 50 registered Holsteins for 17 years before selling the herd shortly after I started college. After that I worked at a few different dairy farms for about five years and then my wife and I decided to come back here and get started and uh, put some cows back in this barn. The single biggest challenge for us was the fact that this barn had been empty for nine years. All of the barn equipment was still here and we knew some of it wasn't going to work. We thought the bulk tank would be fine. It wasn't and when we thought we were a few days away from shipping milk, suddenly we needed to find a new major piece of equipment. Oh, there are days it would be great not to have as much responsibility, but at the same time that's part of what makes it fun, that there's always some kind of challenge we need to overcome, and hopefully one that we realistically can overcome. Uh, that even though the hours are really long and that we're always short of sleep and there's always more than we can accomplish in a day, uh, we at least always have each other. When I was preparing my business plan and trying to decide whether to come here, uh, it was exciting. It was nerve-wracking, trying to make our numbers realistic. At the end of the day, having income over feed cost, milk per stall, ended up winning out in my business plan. And registered Holsteins were most effectively able to generate that income over feed cost every day. We are genomic testing every single calf right now. I love trying to breed a better cow and work with the genetics. Registered Holsteins have the broadest availability of genetics, the largest number of bulls to choose from, and I think it helps me be able to advance my cows faster and correctively mate them, and it really gives me something to work toward here. We realize that we are making food for people and that we have that responsibility to our consumers and that responsibility really goes to our animals too. We know that people expect us to take excellent care of our cows and that we owe, owe them respect. At the end of the day I want every drop of milk that leaves this farm to be something that I'd gladly pour on my own cereal in the morning. <laughs>